Welcome to another Consolidated Auto Car Review. I'm Dean Joseph. And I'm Andrew Mazawana. Together we're going to introduce you to the upgraded Ford Ranger Wildtrak 2.0-litre bi-turbo diesel. As well as the 2.0-litre single-turbo XLT. Because I'm all about looks and appearances, I'm going to cover the Wildtrak's upgraded aesthetics and performance dynamics. And because we all know that beauty is more than skin deep, I'm going to cover its luxurious, comfortable cabin, as well as all of its updated tech features. Are you one of those touchy-feely types? Well, you know how strongly I feel about this car. On that note, let's get started. To my left is the new facelift Ford Ranger XLT, and to my right is the new facelift Ford Ranger Wild Track. What's new about them, you ask? A lot. For example, both have a new bumper, a new grille, xenon headlights, however, only the Wild Track comes with LED daytime running lights and LED fog lights. The XLT retains its chrome bling bling. They also have new engines, a 132 kilowatt, two liter turbo diesel engine that produces 420 newton meters of torque in the XLT. In the Wild Track, a 157 kilowatt, two liter bi turbo diesel engine that produces 500 newton meters of torque. Both engines, well, that one and that one, are mated to a 10 speed automatic transmission. So much technology has been added into the new motors. Mystically, it's like Ford have taken the brain of both Luke Skywalker and Charles Xavier, welded their minds together and combined their powers. Now that sounds more like science fiction than it does rocket science. But there is a bit of rocket science in the new engines. The turbochargers consist of a super alloy metal called Inconel. Inconel is used in rocket engines, impervious to rust, corrosion, warping, and can withstand melting point superheated temperatures and massive amounts of pressure. Not only that, the air intake system has been redesigned through the new grill, designed to catch more air, drive cool, clean air straight into the air filtration system, which has also been insulated from engine heat, dust and moisture. Contributing to the fact that these engines now run smoother than coconut oil and have a fuel economy that will put many small city cars to shame. The Ford Ranger is already renowned for its extravagant driving comfort, and that has improved in the facelift model. It features a lower sense of gravity and upgraded suspension, making it Ford's most balanced small pickup truck ever. How come every time I say the word facelift, I do this? Because driving the new Ranger, it feels like a new generation Ranger really distancing itself from that stigma of farmyard bucky nonsense. You'll be happy to know that the facelift Ranger retains its 3.5 ton brake towing capacity, half ton payload capacity, and all the 4x4 capabilities that you've come to love about the Ranger. However, thanks to the short ratio 10-speed automatic transmission, towing heavier loads is now more comfortable and safer. Last but not least, for you guys without the buys, it has an easy lift tailgate. Check that out. Oh, also available on the XLT. Now that Dean has told us about its exterior design, durability, and toughness, I'm going to make you fall in love with its softer side. Now, as you step inside its comfortable cabin, you'll notice it's wrapped in all black leather with orange contrast stitching, giving the cabin a premium sporty feel. However, the first thing I fell in love with was its keyless system, which includes keyless entry and allows you to start your truck at the touch of a button. As I'm sitting in this comfortable couch-like seat, this gear stick is more like my remote, with the plus and minus buttons which allow you to switch between automatic and manual but I wouldn't recommend switching to manual as this 10 speed gearbox is fitted with a smart system which uses algorithms to learn the way you drive, improving your overall driving experience. Because the Wild Track is a big truck, parallel parking in the city streets can be a bit of a mission. Well, now it can all easily be done at the touch of a button, allowing you to easily park your truck between those inconsiderate sedan and hatchback drivers. Now, let's talk entertainment and technology. The dashboard has been fitted with an 8-inch infotainment system which includes climate control, navigation, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. 
They've even added a convenient spot to place your phone. Another great feature is their voice activated system, which allows you to easily move through apps without taking your hands off its multifunction steering wheel. To ensure that you have clear and crisp sound when making a call, they've also added a microphone to the headboard and installed a noise cancellation system. So let's talk safety. Because the Wildtrak is undoubtedly a family vehicle, the cabin has been fitted with all the necessary safety features, such as seven airbags, an autonomous emergency braking system, and adaptive cruise control. However, please take note that the autonomous emergency braking and parallel parking are only available in the Wildtrak and not the XLT. In conclusion, I have come to a hypothesis, my own humble opinion. I believe that the upgraded Ford Ranger Wildtrak is going to attract the eye of more female buyers, more so than just men. Hear me out. It's an Adonis looking pickup. It doesn't have that predictable Bucky vibe to it. It's a status symbol. And remember, it's been rated one of the safest cars in the world. Yes, with its light steering, it's easy to maneuver, easy to live with, buttermilk driving comfort, and it's powerful. Power that the driver can take control of and wield at will. With all that said, I still believe that the XLT will be one of the top sellers. And here's why. Because most people are cost conscious, and if you're looking for value for money, then the XLT comes with almost all the same features as the Wildtrak, making it a tough contender. So bottom line is they're both awesome vehicles. Yes, and making a choice between the two will be tough. Mm.